Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah Ray Vargas and I have a haul for you today. And this one is actually international. Yay for everybody that's not in America because you guys are always complaining that I'm doing international brands and I feel bad, so here I am. So I ordered some stuff from Boohoo actually just a few days ago. Boohoo is like notoriously awful for their um, shipping to the United States. Apparently it's great if you're like in Europe anywhere. Um, but it sucks here. So I did the like express shipping or whatever. Dude, I ordered this stuff on like Monday and today is Thursday and I got it yesterday, I think, or maybe even two days ago. Um, no, it was yesterday. So <laughs> yeah, I don't wanna give them too much credit, but um, their shipping did great this time. And it also seems like their prices are higher and their return shipping is free, I think. Has it always been like that? I feel like it wasn't, but maybe it was, I can't remember. Um, you still have to return the stuff like Lickety Split if you actually wanted to exchange or get your money back or something. Um, but they're not like Fashion Nova where they only give you a credit back and then they, you buy stuff and then they just give you a credit for your own money and never give you the products. Ugh. But um, I picked up a bunch of stuff because we were going on vacation soon and I wanted to get some cute new outfits. Uh, so let's jump right into the video. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already and sign up for notifications or hit the little bell or whatever and it turns the notifications on so that you know when I post videos. Um, you can follow me on Snapchat and Instagram and also I have a vlog channel where I post a lot of stuff about me. Shout out to Boohoo for always having the damn uh, prices on the invoice though. So they are still relatively inexpensive. Boohoo is um, always having a sale. So <laughs> I got all this stuff 50% off, which like seriously, they're always having a sale. Don't let that counter fool you. It never counts down all the way. Like they always go from sale to sale to sale. So uh, this is a set actually, and it's the Plus Aaron V Bar Bando and Short Set. I got it in a US 18, a UK 22. They say it's the color white and it's $18. It's a really cute set, but it feels like a, I don't know, the material doesn't feel particularly high quality or anything, but I thought the set was just so cute that I had to get it. Unfortunately, they sell the tops and the bottoms in the same sizes, and my top and bottom are nowhere near the same size. So I have to get the top taken in a few inches, unfortunately, because um, it actually is a little bit stretchy, but it has a zipper back here, and it's, as you can tell, it's way too big. Like, there's, there's no part of me, even with the bra on, and this is a push-up padded bra. This is from Torrid, FYI. Um, this bra is, makes my boobs look much bigger than they are, and it still is not even coming close to filling it. So I do have to fix that, but it's worth it because this set was only $18 for the top and the shorts. The shorts, I think, are really cute, and the shorts actually fit. That's why I got an 18, because um, I knew these were not going to be stretchy which they're not. Yeah, I mean, they have elastic on the back here, which is perfect because that's where I always have the butt gaps happening. Um, so they have elastic back there. The only thing I wish it had were pockets. Like I would have paid another $3 for pockets. Um, no pockets though, which is okay. I could always wear it with like a little fanny pack or something, you know, whatever you guys call it, bum bags out there. Call them bum bags because you put them on your, because you got, because, because fannies are other things out there. Am I correct in saying that? Fanny is like a coochie out there. Is that what a fanny is? I don't know, you let me know. Not super duper duper short, but you know, not super long either. I don't hate it. I wish it fit, but I don't hate it. Might as well talk as we get dressed here. I've had a lot of people ask me um, what sizes to order when they're on the actual website, like they get confused. If you go to Boohoo and you're in the US, then click on the little US thing on top, tell it what country you're in, and usually it just defaults there, but tell it what country you're in, and then the sizes are going to be US sizes. So when I say US 18, UK 22, you're clicking on the US version. Um, and obviously if you're in the UK, then you would flip to the UK, and then the sizes would go accordingly, so you would be UK 22, you know, if you were buying the same size as me or whatever. Um, so if you're in the US, order your size how you normally would. They also have size charts, I believe. I never look at them. Um, I just, <laughs> size charts, I don't know. I just like to look at the material, or look at the material. I like to look at the pictures, and then I like to find out what the material is, and that's how I decide what size to buy, because size charts tend to lead me astray. Oh, I was not sure how I was going to feel about this but I like it. Hello? I wasn't sure how this was gonna work because it is like a full off the shoulder, super deep kind of cut, but it's actually not that deep because my bra comes up pretty high and you can't even see it. You guys, huh? 
And then it has like this little puff sleeve happening and um, it gets tighter here so you can actually take that out a little bit or keep it up by the elbow like I probably would. Oh, pair this with like some bangles or something, a nice little, ooh, I actually bought a necklace with this in mind. The Plus Taylor Wrap Ruffle Sleeve Play Suit. I got this in a US 18 and it is in the color black, obviously. And this was only $20. Choker was eight bucks. Says it's like a one size fits all kind of choker, so we'll see if it fits all. I have a 13 inch neck, in case anyone's curious. I'm all about just telling you guys what the inches are right now because my sizes are changing and, okay. Not feeling this, I feel like a, I feel like a bit of a whore right now. I'm not gonna lie to you, but you know, shout out to all the whores out there. Um, okay, hello collarbones. Is that just naturally what's gonna happen when I have this on? Like I'm naturally just become much haughtier. <laughs> okay, I don't know exactly how I feel about this combo, but this is actually so cute. It doesn't have pockets because Boohoo hates us. Um, but the shorts are a really decent length actually. Like it's still short enough that it's very cute and can be, you know, a sexy little outfit. Um, but it's long enough that I would be comfortable wearing this like around family and stuff. And then it has this tie here, which they start out right here. The pieces start on the side here. Um, but it is actually still functional. It still <laughs> tightens you up nice and, you know, like my waist has fully appeared at this party. So it's so cute, you guys. It fits really, really nicely. Very stretchy, so it can accommodate some different bodies. Oh, I am not mad at this at all. This I'm a little mad at, but the rest of this? Oh, did I show you the back? Ha, huh. what, what, what? I love it, because you can still wear a bra. <laughs> I mean, I don't like wearing bras, but sometimes you just need a bra. Next up, this top is actually from like Charlotte Russe or Rue 21 or something. I've got a few of them, a few of them, a few of them in some different colors. Um, I just put it on to show you with these bottoms. So Luigi recently went to Thailand and he brought me back a bunch of like woven shorts, but they were tiny, so tiny. Okay, I wish I had recorded him trying to get them on me because he literally had me up in the air, like from the shorts at my hips. Um, long story short, they didn't fit. So I washed them and dried them and my daughter wears them. Like they're her size. That's how small they were. So I was like, you know what? I like the idea though. I like where you were going with that. I appreciate it. So I decided to pick up some woven shorts from Boohoo. They have a whole bunch. Um, these I got in a US 18, which I should not have done because they are, these are the plus Nancy printed woven short and they're huge. Like they're meant to be big and baggy and loose, but they're even big and baggy and loose on the waist. And even with this tied as tight as it can go, it's still, um, they're so loose. So I should have done a 16 because these are like overly big to the point where they're not really cute anymore. All right, my battery died, so I'm not sure where that cut off. But I was saying they have a bunch of cute um, crocheted like tops and none of them are in plus size, they're all in the straight size. And you know, I can do a smaller top sometimes on top um, if I'm not like including my arms. So a lot of them are just halters or just like bandeaus. So sometimes I can squeeze into those, but they're like size medium large and I'm like, mm, that's a reach. Those are the kind of reaches that people do online. I can't do that in my real life, I can't. So um, yeah, that's why I have this on. But. You know, these are really cute. If you're looking for a cute, like, summery short, and you know, you want something that is very, very, very comfortable, it also very much disguises, like, the belly and everything else. I mean, this is just, like, hella patterns everywhere. They have a bunch of different ones. I saw at least three, so maybe not a bunch. I'm gonna tighten this as much as I can. <laughs> See if we can make it look cute. Um, it, I mean, they are cute, though, still. Like, I would still wear these, probably not with this top, because this top is going to like a dinner and these shorts are going to like the pool, so it's not, it doesn't go together. They are deceivingly short though, like if I just bend a little bit, I have cheek hanging out, so watch out for that. I mean, or pull them down, but I'm not about that life. I like having my stuff like high to the sky. I like it all the way up here. I want that seam right up against my crotch, like that's how I live my life. I don't know how you live yours. All I need in my life are cheap frills, okay? So, how cute! This is a Sarah outfit for me. Like, 
I love tops like this that kind of create a little bit more up here. It looks like, you know, I have a little bit more going on with the ruffles and it kind of covers the shoulder a bit and it covers that little spot over here that I don't like to show all the time. Um, so I love it. I do still have that bra on. Um, I most likely would not wear this with a bra, but if I did, I bet I would wear it with a regular bra, like a regular push-up bra. I mean, because I do like my boobs kind of looking like they came to party. You know what I mean? But even if they came to just chill out and have a drink or whatever, you know, braless, then I, I know it would still look good. I actually tried it on already. So um, these shorts though, hello, hello. So I need some new black trouser shorts. Um, the ones that I have just not sitting quite right lately. So I picked these ones up because Boohoo is hella inexpensive. Once again, no pockets. Why do you hate us, Boohoo? Why? We have things. That's okay, I have purses though. I'm not even tripping. Um, and then there's like a little frill down here at the bottom as well, like a little ruffle that goes all the way around. These ones are not crazy short. Okay, jumping in here from the future to say I had no idea these shorts were that freaking see-through. Oh, you know what? If I bend too far, I will have cheek out, but you know what? Ain't nothing wrong with a little cheek, okay? You can pull them down though. They don't have to be quite as high, like I said. You don't have to wear them quite as high as I do, but um, very, very cute little outfit, I think at least. And the back has decent coverage, so you can actually wear that bra if you want to. Probably a white one or a nude one. Um, and these were so inexpensive. Okay, so inexpensive. This is the Plus Laura Frill crop top. I got this in a US 16. This is ivory. It really looks very white. <laughs> um, yeah, actually, I guess it is ivory because my sheets are white. Um, and this was only $10, what? And then these are the Plus Naomi Ruffle Hem Shorts. These are a US 18 and uh, these were only $12. You guys, this outfit, was 22 bucks and I would pair this with like a flat sandal, maybe like a lacy, not a lacy one, but like a lace up sandal or even like an embellished sandal or a wedge or something. I don't know, probably not a wedge because it's doing the most, but probably a sandal and then like a little crossbody bag or really simple jewelry. Guys, guys, ooh, or really dramatic jewelry if you wanna like bring a little drama to the party. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not that girl, but if you're that girl, I like watching that girl. So if you wanna bring a little drama, bring a little drama. $22 <laughs> to look this cute, excuse me. <laughs> okay, thank you, boo. Back again with the Plus Lily Pineapple Print Frill Play Suit. I got this in a US 18, and this was one of my, actually this was the most expensive thing that I got, and it was $22. Um, Boohoo is like such a discount kind of site, but uh, it does have a little frill to it and it's covered in pineapples if you can't tell. This one kind of makes me feel like a toddler though. Some rompers make me feel like I am out here, I'm the one, that's it, no one can tell me anything. Some of them make me feel like you could probably tell me whatever you want because I'm actually your child and I should go pick up my toys because that's what a responsible three-year-old does. It is a little big as you can see like it comes down a little bit too far in the front and then the back has a zipper on it I can't quite finish zipping it up I don't know if there's a frill stuck in it or what um, but it's definitely like you know I have some extra material so I probably could have done a 16 but because the outside here is not stretchy at all it might have been too tight or it might have been just perfect I'm not sure um, but it's definitely I wouldn't say it runs big at all it's just not my size so uh, it is still super cute and this one is definitely like the longest pair of shorts that I've showed you guys yet. This one has full coverage for sure. No one's escaping there. I mean, unless you have like butt down to your knees, you're good. You're gonna be covered, sister. You're gonna be covered. Look at the little pineapple. Shout out SpongeBob. So this is a very simple little top and this is actually in a US 16. So if you're in between sizes, you could probably size down because it's super duper loose. Um, unless you got a lot of boobies, then Stay where you're at girl and this was only six bucks this is the plus thea neon crop top and then these shorts the plus sarah sarah with an h rainbow cycling short these are an 18 and these were only 10 bucks the model they use the same model for like the entire website she always looks so freaking good though like her, oh, her body just kills it so um she looks super good but she was wearing the gray ones and I was like, there's no structure in these. I love these types of shorts. I get them at Forever 21, um, but there's like no structure in them. So 
I did not want to wear a gray pair that would like be a little more see-through than the black pair. And the black pair is already kind of see-through. Like you can definitely see thong if I bend over or whatever. Um, but they're just so cute. Like the color on the side. Ugh. So they do have the gray pair. Like I said, if you want to be a little bit more adventurous or you can do the black ones. And then I just picked up this crop top that kind of matches with it. I thought it was just a really cute little like chilling out at the crib kind of you know, outfit. I could wear something oversized on top or something, you know, extremely fitted on top or whatever. But this is just a very cute, simple $16 outfit. $16. Where do they do that at? Boo. Okay, this is the Plus Claire Dobby. Dobby. Frill layered cami top. I got this in a US 16. It's pink, obviously. And this was $16. I got it in a 16 and it's still really big. I very much feel like a cupcake in this one. I'm wearing the universal thread shorts that I've shown many times. I sell the tags because I haven't worn them in like real life yet. Um, but I just wanted a pair of shorts to kind of pair these with to show you how I'd wear them. And it would probably be with some denim, but this is really big. Um, Louis just got back and he said it looked like I'm wearing a muumuu. So probably not what you want to hear, you know, <laughs> when you're drawing on your cute new gloves or whatever. Um, so this is a little bit big, but other than that, it's, it feels pretty nice actually. It feels like a nice little quality. It's got multiple layers and then you can actually tie the top however you want. So if you need it to be a little bit further up or down, however you need it. So it does run a little bit big though. Like the, for this to be a 16, this is extremely loose. Um, but other than that, I'm not mad at it. I do feel like a cupcake of sorts, an adorable cupcake, but still, I, I feel like a cupcake. <laughs> More toddler vibes. I love, I love, love, love Boohoo's like oversized shirts like this. I mean, I can just live in them. I wear some to sleep. They have different lengths, whatever. So this one I just had to get because this color was calling my name and then it just says baby needs a minute. And I was like, okay, that's hella cute for once. Um, so this was only, I think like 10 bucks. This is the Plus Margot Baby Needs a Minute t-shirt. I got this in a 16, again, US 16. It's only $10 and it's super big, very flowy. So definitely don't go crazy with the sizing on this because I have ordered them many sizes bigger before and it's like draping off of me in a very unflattering way. So I just wear those ones to sleep. But this I just thought was so cute. It'd be cute in the summertime, you know, with like denim shorts or little bicycle shorts or whatever, just something easy but still makes me look like I tried like this, this much. That's, that's how much I wanna try. This one was an unexpected little purchase. I wasn't sure about it, but I saw it and I loved it. I saw it in black though, and I decided not to get that because like that's just so safe, but also very classic. So if you were gonna get this dress and you weren't sure about this color, the black one looks fire. The Plus Laura Scuba Blazer dress, I did get it in a US 18 because I wasn't sure how tight it was gonna be. Um, this is in the color Baby Pink and this was only 20 bucks. So it is a scuba material if you're familiar. Um, the play suit was also like a scuba material and I would 100% wear shapewear underneath this, not just because of like the panty lines, obviously the indentations on my body, but also because it's such a light color. I'm not sure that it's really my color, you know, cause I feel like it almost kind of washes me out, but I also kind of love it. Like with a really dramatic look actually, with like dramatic makeup and my, you know, hair being dark or darker, I don't know. I, I'm on the fence about my hair. Like I love when it grows out, but it just doesn't look the best when it grows out. So I don't know what to do. And I don't know if I want to color it or not. Uh, I don't know. Um, but I'm constantly screenshotting people's hair on Instagram so that I can have a little, little inspiration in case I just pop into the salon one day. But um, overall, this actually fits really nicely. Uh, not too tight anywhere, pretty much. A little loose in the boob area, but what else is new? My name is Sarah Ray, and this is what I live with. So um, other than that, it has these like two buttons. And you can actually take the buttons apart. Like, I mean, it has those two and then it has these two, obviously it's like double breasted or whatever, <laughs> double torso I guess. Um, and it comes completely apart if you were trying to rock that look. But I think overall, it's just a really pretty dress, something a little bit different. Like I don't really have any blazer dresses. It's a decent little length. Like I said though, definitely 
definitely you're gonna need some shapewear if you don't want everything to be seen because it is kind of transparent all right so that is all that I have for you guys today I hope that you enjoyed the video give it a like if you did if you want to see more like this or any other inexpensive retailers that you guys want to see I know you want to see rainbow um, and I'm working on a video for that trying to figure out exactly what my direction is gonna be um, because I was thinking of not just doing a haul, but doing more like a challenge video. But um, we'll see what ends up happening there. But if you have any other inexpensive retailers or international retailers that you want to see me cover and show you and talk about and all that, then let me know down in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up if you like air. Yeah. And make sure that you subscribe and um, hit that bell so you can get notifications. Otherwise, you'll probably miss some videos because YouTube plays my whole life all the time. Um, but other than that, I hope that you're having a really good day and I'll have links for everything down in the description box. And that's it. Smile you later. Bye guys.